What's up guys? In today's video, we're gonna be checking out Jocko Ohanen. Have you guys heard of this guy, Jocko? He's a Finnish skater that just released a video part in DC's Domino video. Now, if you've seen this part, it is absolutely mind-blowing. We're gonna watch it today while I tell you more about Jocko. You're gonna see some of the most unique skating that you'll ever see. This guy is mind-blowing. So, I'm about to start this video part so you guys can watch it while I tell you about his backstory. His come up and just a little bit more context about Jocko Ohanen and where he came from. But before that guys, I hope that I can earn your like in this video. If these are the kind of videos that you guys want to see, subscribing and thumbs up really lets me know what to make more of. So with that in mind, let's start this video part. Alright, so we've got the classic Thrasher opening here. Very good, very good. So Jocko is really interesting because uh, one of the one of the things that sets him apart from other skaters is uh, he has broken his back three times, recovered from that three. Ooh, just skating on dirt, no problem. Anyways, he has had a really hard come up uh, story, but basically what's what's happened is, I I love this part right here with the switch one eight. Uh. <laughs> He's so steezy, so steezy. Anyways, oh gosh. It's hard to talk when there's so many bangers just happening. But yeah, so he broke his back three times. And uh, the third time he finally had a surgery that corrected... That trick is gnarly. That finally corrected it. And uh, now he's been skating fine since then. However, he still gets back pains. And he stopped skating... This part's gnarly. Watch this fakey flip out. Yeah! <laughs> Barely holding on. But he stopped skating big drops for the most part. So now he does more like tech and creative stuff. And so his back injury is kind of what pushed him into this unique way of skating that honestly uh, sets him apart from pretty much uh, anybody else. It's very uh, Daywon Song, Mark Sushu esque, like very progressive and unique. And so who knows if, if he wouldn't have had to uh, go through all the back issues if he would still have, you know, like the same kind of. Uh, progressive unique skating that really sets him apart one thing that to me really sets him apart is he's got a really chill laid-back style which always looks good I don't care who you, who you are or what tricks you can do it never you never get tired watch this day one right here Oof. you never get tired of somebody that has really good style so but yeah so he was born in this Finnish town called Tempere uh, not a whole lot going on there. Uh, in his late teens, he broke his back and uh, kept on having like these injuries. And in a four-year period, I love that Wally. He actually only skated one year over a four-year period because he was constantly battling injuries. And so he was he was getting ready to quit skating, and then he finally got the surgery that he needed and was able to stay in the game. And thank goodness because look at this, like, this is insane. He actually, uh, he, he came up pretty quick. He's, he's already 25, 26, so kind of, you know, a late bloomer. Um, but because of the injuries, that I love that. I love that gap to 50-50, can't flip out. I love the spots that he skates. They're very unique, because he's, he's uh, you know, European skater, so you don't always see these spots. Yeah, that's sick. Anyways. This straight flips gnarly. Uh, so yeah, he, he's uh, he's had a, a hard go of it, but in, in 2016, he got introduced to the Element team manager and uh, finally got on Element Europe and then became just the absolute uh, force to be reckoned with in the European skate scene. And then in 2019, um, he finally went pro for uh, Element, like global, the whole like actual team. And uh, he's only had a few video parts, like, at all, because of his injury. But also, he is one of these skaters, like Versace Plug and Little Dre, that has made a name for himself on Instagram. <laughs> that trick. <laughs> on Instagram, before uh, he ever got big in the, the mainstream skate industry. So, at one point, he said that in Finland, nobody knew who he was. 
uh, but people in the United States recognized him. Like, because he was blowing up in the American scene through Instagram. Uh, but yeah, people in Finland, look okay, at this Ender. What? What? It's just like stuff we've never seen before, you know? Like, it's very rare that you get somebody that comes in and like does it different than the rest. And like his style and trick selection and like creativity sets him apart big time. It's good on him. He has had a hard road to the top. But I, I hope he keeps putting out video parts. I don't know how his back is gonna hold up. Like, let's pray that he never has to get back surgery again and, and that he can just keep skating like he is because he's absolutely ripping. And uh, yeah, like I said, it, it is, look at this. Some of the most entertaining skating that you'll ever see. The style, the, the, the effortlessness, like, Jocko's the real deal. The only reason I stumbled upon Jocko was because of Gary Rogers and Skateline MVD. And like I keep up with skating pretty well, I, I'd like to think, but I, I didn't know who Jocko was. And that's why I wanted to make this video was to kind of shine the light on him a little bit more because he deserves the credit. I think he's only had, you know, like one or two video parts, but because he's been crushing it on Instagram, he's been able to get his skating out there to a lot of people, so like if you're on Instagram a lot, then you've probably seen clips of him in like your discovery section, but didn't know. I know I, I know I have like, I see him and I'm like, yeah, you look familiar, but I never knew his name and never followed him or anything, but he deserves all the recognition. I, I If he can stay healthy and keep progressing like he is, I mean, he could be, he could be Sody, but more than that, like, I just want to see like, good skating and like this is something else. I think I could watch him like forever. It's like Gary Rogers has Mark Sushu and uh, I have Jocko, you know? There's like certain skaters that you can just, you never get tired of watching and I seriously, I could watch him forever. You know that a skateboarder has something when watching them makes you want to go skate. When you watch their video part and you want to get up and go skate, like you know that they did their job. So uh, props to Jocko. I know I want to go skate. Uh, so yeah, if you ever need like a pick me up before a sesh, watch this part, follow his Instagram because it's just pure beautiful skateboarding and it will get you pumped to get out there and crush it. So thank you so much for watching this video guys. I hope I earned your thumbs up. I hope that was useful information. Maybe you know a little bit more about the background and context of Jocko Ohanen, our Finnish ripper. Leave a like, give me your thumbs up if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're into these kind of videos and the content that I put out. But again guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.